This is Coon Cassius for Eiffel TV in association with Macklin's in Marbella. We're at the final, I've just lost here, I've just, your dad's putting me off and this is all going wrong. Daddy Cole. Uh, Rumble on the Humber, final press conference with me, I've got Tommy Cole. How are you? Very good mate, looking forward to it now. Yeah. Uh, not as high key as the first press conference. No, um, down to business now, isn't it? 48 hours till the fight, I've got, uh, I've got my game face on, shall we say. You know, all the talking's done, the talking's over. Um, got to go in there on Saturday now, got my mind on the job and um, execute the game plan. Mm, absolutely. Um, I mean, like I said, it's, the fight has kind of sold itself. Uh, I said after the initial press conference, uh, you know, it didn't need that, like you kept saying, that sort of bad blood and uh, those sort of negative feelings between the two of you. It's just sort of got on. A couple of things have been said, but ultimately it was the fight that mattered and that's what will count come Saturday night. Yeah, for, for sure. Um, there's always going to be a little bit of needle in a build-up. You're going in there and you're punching each other in the head. It's a, uh, it's it's a hurt game. So, you know, I, I was disappointed in some of the things Luke had said uh, in the build-up. You know, and just just forgotten uh, how close we was. You know, growing up, uh, didn't feel it needed to be, you know, that way. Could, the fight could have been sold to the public, you know, two lads getting in the ring having a tear up and the best man will win. Um, but what's been said has been said, it's done now and um, the talking don't really matter. It's about what's going to happen on Saturday night and um, I guess the action will do the talking. We should certainly see, let's just hope the weather holds out. And uh, Eddie's ordered it, he said from the Met. He said, is he? So he said. I think he spoke to Jesus, actually. <laughs> yeah. He made a deal, yeah. I think Matchroom is signing Jesus very soon. They've signed get, Buffer. Do not get Daddy Coyle on Jesus, by the way. Really? What, why do you keep filming him and aggravating him, by the way? <laughs> Just for Banner. Yeah, come here, Daddy Coyle. C come here, come here. Because I always see these little snidey <laughs> videos of him and of you going mental in your house. Do you know that he's filming you when he's doing well, this? Well, if I fucking knew he was filming, I wouldn't let him fucking put our spoons on back in my head, would I? <laughs> Silly bastard. Would you have a, <laughs> you have a fucking hot spoon on No, I wasn't talking about that one, but I'm just talking about when you're like no, eating and... I, I'll pop the video up somewhere, then I'll sit somewhere. He's sick. <laughs> he ain't got a clue. <laughs> don't, don't you ever feel like... Listen, if it floats his fucking boat, taking the piss out of his own man, let him get on with it. It's an hard enough spot. They're all cunts in this game, so let him have a laugh with a giggle. That's what I say, Coogie. And a bit Coogie. of strawberries and cream. Coogie, Coogie, Coogie. Oh, Coogie, come on. So, uh, how you been anyway, Daddy Cole? Strawberry I'm going well? Attack, Coogie. Right. He's fucking listen to this, right? So I'm walking down the street the other day, and this woman said, how is your dad, how is your dad? I said, he's all right. I said, uh, you know, he's had a, he's had a, a a minor heart attack, then he had a, a big, big heart attack. Big, listen, a minor heart attack, then a big heart attack. He went, the lying bastard. He told me he had a triple heart bypass. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> laughing. Arms I'm and legs on everything. So listen to this. this isn't you even didn't the, milk a heart listen, attack. This isn't even the best bit. So listen to this, cool, right? He says, um, this woman This woman says, they've had to staple him, haven't they? I says, what? He says, he's told me that they've stapled his chest yeah, and, and, and if he gets pain, he has to put his hand in his chest and he has to pump it himself. I says, oh my <laughs> days. I says, he's not had that. I said, he's had a few stents. I said, and he's all right. She went, the lying bastard. <laughs> Go get, I don't set the tablets. I just set fucking strawberries. They've got healing proper power. <laughs> How do you see the fight going, Daddy Cole? Give me a, give me a prediction, or, or a round, or what do you reckon? Jocks, jocks are sad, Cole. We all know what he is. Blah, blah, blah. I hope he breaks his fucking jaw in the first round and gets him straight out of there. I'll tell you just how it is, Cole. He can't be done with that fucking lot of West Hull that can go fuck themselves. I'm an East Hull kid, and I hope he gives him it round one and smashes his fucking head in, then shake hands. We'll go home early, get pissed and have a good time. Oh, all the rest of us will be out of Campbell. <laughs> yeah. And that'll do us go, won't it? Other than that, let the best man win, but it's my son who wins. Right. I don't had so much money and so much lamb like that, cunt. Let my son have a bit. <laughs> do, you know, do you know what? I don't know a lot, a lot about the rivalry between East and West Hull. Is it a bit like the South, South and West? Uh, it's, in? it's literally just like the rugby. It's, just it's East and West. It's just out of the cellar fight, isn't it? Luke's, Luke's a great No, but is there a, is there a, is there a colour I can't wear? That's They're both so good lads, Colby. And let's, let's just let him have a proper old-fashioned settler in the middle of a ring 
and let everybody be happy. Yeah, we'll all I, be happy. I then. agree. That's you're all sure that now, you, I don't know what you're going to say. I think you've said too much. Yeah, well, I think you've said too much. You'll only do the wrong bits on that, won't you? No, we're putting it in raw. Yeah. And you've lost a lot of weight, Gilgi. Yeah, we're, we're not cutting this out. I don't Karen. know if you got a bit of that fucking clap from the camper man last time. You oh! He's <laughs> 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 Yeah. That is down. scandalous. I think you've got a bit of the clap from the that, man. that is disgusting and scandalous. <laughs> Can you apologise to my other half, please? Yeah, he's got a wife. He's Listen, love, wife. I'll tell you. If he's got married, it doesn't matter. He will bang at it with a bird. Oh, oh, he's 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 go away. He's go killed away. you there. Go away. <laughs> and it's not chlamydia. Go away. <laughs> Go away. No, I've got a warning sign at the front of this. Brilliant. You asked for that though, didn't you, saying uh, he's going out raw? Alright, maybe, maybe, maybe I did, but we don't read really like to edit anything, so anyway, I've lost focus of what's going on. You and we're Campbell are fighting fight apparently. Saturday, that's it. Yeah, we're having a fight. <laughs> you know, we're fighting Saturday. Alright, listen, not gonna drive you mad. Uh thanks to all the Trifle TV, we'll catch up with you um after the weigh in tomorrow and uh rumble on the Humber. Rumble, Looking young man, rumble. That's the one. Alright. Cheers, mate. Anytime.